Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to talk about how you can uh, improve uh, Mattermost thanks to uh, github.com. Um, what I'm going to take as an example is the one of the group permission plugins, uh, which is the plugin that I show out of a previous video tutorial. And um, in this plugin, what I noticed is that there were no possibility to use auto completion. Uh, so to say, when you create uh, a new group for, uh, for your user, for example, here, let's imagine that I would like to add, uh, let's say, Moran, for example, so I'm just going to delete her over here. Okay, I want to add uh, a new member to this group. So I'm going to add like Moran, and, and as you can see, uh, there's no auto completion here, which means that if I don't have the member name right, uh, it won't be able uh, to, to tell me if this user exists, which is of course uh, a bit annoying. So what I did is that I went uh, on GitHub some um, days ago and I write an issue about it. So I went on the plugin, which uh, of course is the plugin of uh, the, the developer. And I decided to open an issue. This is the issue that I open up. Uh, so add an auto completion field to find existing users. Here I explain uh, what were my, um, let's say my uh, expectations. Hello, here is a feature suggest. Currently the plugin does not automatically search the name of user uh, to add them to group created. Could you please perform an auto completion? I think that uh, your tickets has more chances uh, to be taken by the developer if it's kind of obvious. If the feature suggests that you want is definitely a missing feature and not require a lot of uh, development. And here I got the answer from the developer. Hello, uh, thank you for your feedback. The completion has been added in version 4.04. Uh, so then uh, what I did is that I went over here on the marketplace and I saw that yes, um, he developed uh, some patches. In fact, he did even more than this because if you look at the changelog, he added uh, in the version 4.04 the all user in the add group uh, user section manage group and well and as well he created uh, uh, another uh, as well he fixed the JS uh, issue. So once uh, the ticket has been um, let's say filled in by the developer, which is the case here, um, normally Matomo will fetch automatically the let's say the updates, which is the case over here as you can say it's telling you okay. Uh, by the way, the developer of this given plugin, oh, in fact, he made like three changes. So he fixed as well, fixed the site section, manage access, add drop down menu. Okay, great. So it's uh, probably it's, um, it's doing a lot of things. So uh, now I can select it and I can update it. So as you can see here, I created the ticket like six days ago and the answer to me like nine hours ago. So it took like a week in order to fix it out. Okay, uh, so now we're going to see if uh, the issue has been fixed. I mean, the feature suggest has been implemented. Uh, so uh, now I would like to add, ah, okay, that's great. As you can see, it's automatically looking at uh, now all the members which are within. That, that's really impressive. And now I can I can add more uh, this well, that That's really great. So um, as you can see here, uh, you saw how you can within Matomo uh, suggest a feature through github.com, then explain uh, what is your expectation in terms of feature development, and then you get the answer from the developer, and then you update the plugin, and then you get the feature that you want. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.